Hello and welcome to this Themify screencast. Over the next couple of minutes, I'm going to quickly show you how you can use Themify Builder to build and customize your website. I'm going to get started straight away by dropping into this blank page I set up and turning on Builder by hovering over on the admin bar and clicking turn on Builder. This brings up Builder's interface and you can see here at the bottom I have the modules and up here I have Builder's grid and this is resizable and I can create the grid layout I want. I'd like a slider on the top left grid. I'm just going to drag and drop the slider. Dropping the slider brings up this interface where I can choose the content I want to display here. So I'm gonna go for blog posts in the category news with three posts to display, no extra content, and I'm going to leave the rest of those options as they are by default. Hit save on that and that's going to generate that slider. To accompany the slider on the right hand side, I'm gonna drop in a text module. Just drag and drop. As the text module supports short codes, here I can just switch to text mode and drop in this short code here. Hit save on that and that's going to generate those images. Moving on down the page then, I'm just gonna show you a couple more modules. You can see this new grid is automatically created below. So I'm just gonna change this grid so it's in three equal sized columns here. And I'm gonna populate this grid with three more modules here. So we'll start off with the map module, which I'm gonna drop into this middle one here. And here I just need to pop in the address I want. So I'll just go for London, UK. I can add a title if I'd like to. So let's add one here. Hit save and that's gonna generate that map. And I'm gonna flank that with a gallery. Just drag and drop where you want it and it will bring up the options. And here clicking insert gallery will bring up the WordPress media library. So I'd like six images here. So I'm just gonna choose those six and hit add to gallery. So I'm gonna hit save which will generate that gallery of six images there. On the right hand side of our map, I'm gonna drop in an image module. So I just need to find the image module, drag and drop it in. I'm gonna browse my library for an image to display here. And we'll just go for that one in the middle there. And then when I'm happy with the rest of those options, just hit save and that generates that image there. So moving on down the page, I'm gonna create a new grid below this one. I'm gonna start off by dropping in a menu. So just drag and drop the menu module. And then that brings up the options where I can select one of the custom menus I've created using the WordPress menu creator. So I'd like my main menu displaying here and I'll go for rounded without the gradient. Directly below my menu, I'm going to drop in a tabbed area. So to drop a module directly below, just drag and drop and Builder will create space for it there. And here I'm just gonna go for a standard tabbed layout and just gonna drop in some dummy content here. I'm happy with that, so I'm just gonna hit save. I'm just gonna generate my tabs. I'm gonna show you the widget module and you can use this to display any widget you've got set up with your WordPress installation. So I'm gonna go for the just the calendar just to show you how this works. If I'd like to display another widget below my calendar widget here, I can do so just by duplicating the module and then editing it to change the type of widget. So here I can just hover over, hit duplicate, and then double click or hit the edit button to bring back up that options panel. And here I'll just display my archives with the title archives. If I wanted to change those around, I could just drag and drop. To display a whole widgetized area though, I just need to drag and drop the widgetized module where I'd like it to go. So I'd like this on the far right hand side. And here I can select the widgetized area I'd like. And I'm gonna go for sidebar here. Hit save on that and that's gonna drop the whole sidebar onto my builder grid. So now if I turn off builder, you can see what we've created in just a couple of minutes. This three column layout with the menu, the tabs, and the widgets and the widgetized area. This equal three column layout of gallery, map, and image. And at the top, I've got this magazine style slider and featured content area. Themeify Builder is available in all Themeify themes or as a standard WordPress plugin which works with any theme, whether it's a premium theme, a framework, or a custom built theme. It's completely responsive and works on desktop, tablet, and mobile. Thank you very much for watching.